I had a very special request from one of my subscribers to create a video on products that don't contain any coconut or shea butter. Not just coconut or not just shea, but both coconut and shea butter. I know it's taken me a little time to create this, but it's finally here. I'm finally making this video. And I just realized there are so many of you that have allergies or sensitivities to a lot of ingredients. And I wanna be able to address those issues and give you options. This is actually my second time filming this video. I filmed it a while ago, but then I had to throw the entire video away because I realized some of the products I was mentioning still had derivatives of coconut and shea butter. And yeah, I couldn't, I couldn't put that out because I really wanted to dig a little deeper and do a little bit more research to see if I could get rid of all of the derivatives as well. Now I'm going to do my very best, but if I make a mistake, let me know down below in the comments if the, if the brand changed their formula, if there is a derivative of coconut or shea butter, just let me know down below in the comments. I will add a comment and pin it to the top so you know which product is no longer on that list. I'll also put it in the description box. Now I wanna put this little disclaimer out there. In case you didn't know, I'm not a doctor, I'm not an allergist. I'm just basing this off of the ingredients, what I'm reading online or on the packaging. Even though I'm sharing this with you, I still need you to be your own hair detective, all right? Please do your research, do a patch test, test the inner elbow, test the nape of your neck, wait 24 hours. Do you have any redness? Do you have any irritation? Is it swollen? You know, like do that before you actually try a product out. But most importantly, if you have a severe allergy, like you need an EpiPen, okay, talk to your doctor first. Don't even try it. Don't even test it out. Talk to your doctor first about the ingredients. Make sure that they're going to work for you. So I put these in categories. You got shampoos, your co-washes, your conditioners, deep conditioners, curl creams, gels, and edge control. I tried to cover the majority of products out there. Finding these products was not easy. I did not want to do the research. Every time I found something, I'd find a derivative after doing the research and I have to like start all over again. So it took me a long time to get there. And some of these options are not typical. You might have to do just a little bit of DIY with it. But I pray that I got this right for you all because I want to help my friends with the coconut and shea allergies. So let's start with the shampoos. Okay, let's dive into the first category, which is shampoo. The first shampoo is by a brand called Pectolite. This is a brand new brand. I've never heard of it before until I did the research for this video. So this is the Pectolite Harmony Coconut-Free Probiotic Allergy Shampoo. You can get this at pectolite.net. Um, it's a coconut-free allergy shampoo. It uses plant-based ingredients and botanicals. It's raw, vegan, and sustainably sourced. Coconut free, palm free, soy free, gluten free, sulfate free, and chemical free. I did check the ingredients. I did not see any derivatives of shea butter as well, so I felt comfortable suggesting this one first. Next on the list is Clean Kids Naturally Tropical Orange Birth Shampoo. You can get this at GabrielCosmeticsInc.com. This uses orange and lime to gently and deeply clean. It uses seaweed and aloe vera extract to stimulate and balance. It is safe for color-treated hair. It's free of gluten, sulfates, parabens, phthalates, fluoride, glycol, lanolin, petroleum, mineral oils, coconut, and artificial colors. I did check the ingredients. I did not see any derivatives of shea butter as well. And yes, it's for kids, but really who cares because there's not a lot of options out there. Next on the list is Terra Essentials Lavender Garden Pure Earth Hair Wash. This is available at terraessentials.com. This is a clay-based cleanser that provides medium moisture. I would say it's not going to be for everyone. This is made for detoxing the scalp and hair from chemicals and plastic polymers that are found in your everyday shampoos and conditioners and styling products. It works well for normal to dry, naturally curly, wavy, kinky, medium to coarse, and thicker hair types. Now we're moving on to the co-washes. I could only find one, but I am excited about the brand I found because it seems to have everything that is coconut and shea butter free. The brand is Naturally Free, and this is their Rasul Clay Co-Wash. You can find this at naturallyfree.com. It's a co-wash that moisturizes, repairs hair strands, prevents hair loss and breakage with avocados. It's plant-based and 100% natural, unscented, and it makes detangling really easy, and it says it's good for all porosities. It's 
going to help clump and define your curls, eliminate frizz, add shine, and slip. I do have just a couple options for conditioner. One is your traditional conditioner and the other is not. The more traditional conditioner is also by Naturally Free. It's their watermelon strengthening conditioner. I messed up on the last slide. It is naturallyfreeink.com. So this is a rinse off conditioner or protein hair mask. You can use it both ways. It moisturizes your curls, prevents hair loss and breakage, and it also rebuilds the hair shaft with watermelon amino acids. A non-traditional option would be the Egyptian Magic All-Purpose Skin Cream. I bet nobody thought about using this. Maybe you have, but I didn't. Uh, so this is an all-purpose skin cream, but it can be used on the face, body, nails, cuticle, and the hair. So if you are going to use this on your hair, it can be used as a hair conditioner, a frizz tamer, to mend your split ends, and a hot oil treatment. If you are using this as a hair conditioner, I would suggest using it mainly on your ends because it is a smaller jar and it will probably go really quickly if you use it on your entire head. Moving on to our deep conditioners, the first one is also by Naturally Free. It's their Cocoa Moisture Hair Mask. It's an intense deep conditioning hair mask. It contains cocoa powder for a natural chocolate scent. It softens, detangles, and adds slip. It hydrates and repairs dry, brittle hair. It provides UV protection. It's protein free, and it's going to help combat hair loss, dandruff, and scalp psoriasis. The next hair mask is by Morocco Method. It's their mineral mud hair mask. You can get this at shop.moroccomethod.com. It's a raw, vegan, and paleo formula, handcrafted with French clay and moisture rich oils. It's a multi purpose formula that can be used also as a face and neck mask. It's also great for pedicures and can be used to treat back acne and prevent scarring. It hydrates and improves the condition of dry, damaged hair. And I really love that this is a multi-purpose product. I do have another mask by Belbar Organics. This is their Guacamole Ultra Nourishing Hair Mask. This is a semi-DIY because they provide the ingredients and then you add to it. So this is a powerful moisturizing treatment. It's great for all hair types, but especially low porosity. It's going to restore hair health, treat split ends, and leave behind moisturized, shiny hair. Next, we have the leave-in conditioners. And surprise, surprise, it's by Naturally Free. I'm telling you, you're going to see a lot of Naturally Free on this list because it was one of the only brands that just had no coconut or shea. So this is their Raspberry Hair Detangler. It's a curl-defining detangler and leave-in conditioner. It provides 24-hour hold and shine and it doesn't leave any white residue or flakes. Also by Naturally Free, they have their Curl Defining Okra Leave-In. It's a curl defining leave-in conditioner. It eliminates frizz, adds shine and slip, provides 24 hour hold and shine, repairs and hydrates dry, brittle hair, and it's gonna help combat hair loss, dandruff, and scalp psoriasis. I did find one curl cream that is also by Naturally Free, and it's their Sunflower Hair and Body Moisturizer. This is another multi-purpose product that I'm in love with. It can be used on the hair, face, lips, and body as a moisturizer. It can also be used for shaving and as a deep conditioner. It's good for all porosity levels. It's gonna hydrate and repair dry and brittle hair. It's going to seal in the hair moisture, and it has a natural SPF of 40. Oh my goodness, that's amazing. Imagine putting that on your hair when you're in the sun. I love the idea of this. I think I might actually order this one because it looks promising and it does so many things. Okay, we've made it to the hair gels. The first is by Kinky Curly. I bet you thought I was gonna say naturally free. This is their curling custard available at kinky-curly.com. It's an all natural gel that eliminates frizz, locks in moisture, defines curls, adds shine, and provides long lasting hold. Used regularly, it will help maintain moisture and reduce breakage. I do like Kinky Curly, so this is a great brand to add to the list. I also found that the Uncle Funky's Daughter Curly Magic Curl Stimulator did not contain any coconut or shea butter. So this is a firm hold gel that defines, adds shine, moisture, tames frizz, and it elongates your curls. It contains natural ingredients like organic aloe vera for moisture and agave nectar. It does have what I consider a unisex fragrance, and the way you want to apply this is to soaking wet hair. You can get this at UncleFunkiesDaughter.com. But yes, I do have one gel from Naturally Free. This is the Curl Defining Okra Gel. This is a light hold. 
gently defines with a soft hold. It contains a vegetable protein. It moisturizes, eliminates frizz, adds shine and slip. It hydrates and repairs dry, brittle hair, and it's going to help combat hair loss, dandruff, and scalp psoriasis. Okay, we have made it to the edge control, and I do have one in mind. This is by Kemet Biologics. I hope I didn't butcher that name, but this is the Castor and Amla hair pomade. You can get this at KemetBiologics.com. This is a moisture, shine, and hair growth pomade, 100% vegan, mineral oil, and petroleum oil free. It's going to help nourish the scalp, encourage growth, and soften your edges, and it uses pure castor oil and Ayurvedic amla oil. And that completes my video on curly hair products that do not contain any coconut or shea butter. I'd love to hear from all of you now. Let me know if you like this video. Also, if you have any more suggestions on products, let us know down below in the comments because this will be a wealth of information for people that are looking for these products. If you're new to my Fine Curly Crew, I'd love to have you subscribe and please don't forget to turn on your notification bell so you know when I'm posting new content. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like and comment and share and I'll see you on the next video.